What's up everybody? Ethan back today with a beer review and what I've got today is a beer I don't think I've ever reviewed. I've reviewed a lot of its contemporaries but this is Bush Ice 5.9%. This is the big one 25 ounce can. <clears throat> like I said I don't believe I've ever reviewed this guy. I've done Bud Ice. I've done Natural Ice. I've done Keystone Ice, uh, Ice House even, um, which is kind of hard to find now, but never actually done uh, Bush Ice, so I wanted to do this. I bought a Bud Ice as well, 25 ounce. Both cans were $1.99 a piece, so that's a pretty good, pretty good deal. Uh, let's go ahead and get a pour in my round tulip glass. Turned out to be a really beautiful day today. Uh, earlier it was raining, light rain, but dreary, cloudy, cold. Uh, clouds have cleared up, cleared up. Rain's moved on. Sun's coming out. It's in the upper 50s. It's pretty cool. Uh, cool for late April, but it's been so warm. The last week we were in the mid 80s and even like 87 one day. So not unusual for us to get cooler again in late April. But yeah, it feels good out here. Nice and comfortable. So. Uh, the aroma is a sweet, corny maltiness. Really kind of a nice aroma. Cheers. Let's go ahead and get into it. And very minimal head on that. Very minimal head at 5.9%. Very carbonated. A sparkly carbonation. Really quite good, though. It's kind of light. I will say that it's light for 5.9%. Um, really, it has almost a lighter body than like a Miller High Life. Really clean and clear tasting. <clears throat> really quite um, refreshing and drinkable, though. Really crisp. Just got done working out, so this is a good um, hydrator after working out. But, you know, not as good as water. I did have some water as well. Um, this is a pretty good beer. It's not great, though. I mean, it's a it's a cheap American adjunct lager. I mean, it's bush ice. It's, it's the kind of beer you see thrown out of cars on the side of the road. Like, it's, it's a quick buzz kind of beer. It's not high quality, high class beer. But it's pretty good. Um, it's better than Bud Light, Miller Light, Coors Light. It has a little more body in 5.9%. <clears throat> You're getting more bang for your buck. So it's not a it's not a horrible beer, but it's not great. I'm gonna go B, 86 out of 100. Pretty good ice beer. I would say it, it stands up well or compares well to Bud Ice, Natural Ice. Maybe not quite as good as Natural Ice. Keystone Ice was probably the best one, but that was discontinued in 2021. I missed that one. I got that a good bit. That had the most flavor of any ice beer, the most body, and tasted the most like a regular beer as opposed to an ice beer. But yeah, Bush Ice, it's pretty good. I'm going to continue to drink on it and sip on it and enjoy it. Quite refreshing. 86 out of 100 for the Bush Ice. Cheers and thank you for watching this review on this beautiful day.